Hello, Internet. This is JJ. Welcome to another speed drawing. And uh, yeah, I'm trying to do things a little bit differently this time. Um, for the most part, I will just go through and talk about what I am doing. So in this speed drawing, I wanted to do a holiday themed something. And I decided to have Rel Rel holding a present. And I really didn't have any idea what it was going to look like. So I just kind of, you know, went forward and started doodling and whatnot. And, uh, yep, usually I draw the characters nude first. You know, I draw guys and girls nude. It's just so that you can get the, you know, so that their clothes drape over their bodies correctly and everything like that. And, uh, yep, so I moved on, started the scarf. And at this point, um, I had an idea of how I wanted the present to look. But I really, you know, wasn't too sure. Messed around with a couple bows. And... Yeah, at this point, I honestly don't have any idea what I'm doing. I just pretty much just go with whatever looks right. And, um, oh, and as you can see in the top right corner, I decided to use what I had from the drawing talk in the last video and um, use the little window over there so you could see the progress. I didn't know that I could do that in Flash. So you can watch over there in the window and see everything progress without, you know, the screen shifting and moving so much. And you're, you know, you can get an idea of what it's going to look like. Which is uh, pretty good. So, and I didn't realize it until after, but that looks like a, a Gryffindor scarf. But I eventually start coloring it green for, well, obviously for Christmas. But since Rel Rel is based off of my wife Jen and she created Rel Rel, it also fits because, um, as far as Harry Potter goes, my wife is Slytherin, which is <laughs> pretty cool. You know, the she took a couple tests and the sorting hat sorted her into the Slytherin, Slytherin house. I'm Ravenclaw, because, you know, Ravenclaw's rock, and I love blue, which works out. But anyways, so, yeah. How's everybody doing? Seeing as how this is a holiday-themed uh, speed drawing, I guess I should say, you know what? Merry Christmas, Happy Holidays, and whatever it is that you celebrate, hey... Hope everything is going good. Hope the season's treating you nice. Everything's going well. So, yeah. So, there we go. See? Slytherin scarf. That's what's up. It's not really the right green color for Slytherin, but that's okay. Yeah. Talking and doing this at the same time is kind of weird. Never really done it before, so I guess I'll just keep running my mouth. And hopefully this is interesting and uh, you enjoy it. So, yeah, the present, I had no idea what I wanted to color it. I initially wanted to make it all blue since I'm, I don't know, blue is my favorite color. So I was going to go with that, but uh, I'll eventually change it to something else. You know, purplish because Rel's favorite color is purple because obviously Jen's favorite color is purple. So, yeah. <clears throat> and for this drawing, I decided to go back to my original um, shading technique because uh, I don't know. I'm more comfortable with it, and I like the way that come that ah, I'm well stuttering over everything. I like the way that it comes out. It's just you know my personal preference and uh, style-wise, it's. I don't know. I like it. Hope you like it too. Yeah. So here we go. Coloring, shading, adding all the little finishing details. And um, a lot of you may have noticed that I usually do all the shading all in one go. And then what I do is I turn it into a movie clip so that I can use the, what are they called? The layer styles. And I use an overlay. And it it's kind of a cheat because... Um, I'm not really shading everything with a specific color. I kind of let the program do it. Uh, if, I don't know if that makes sense. It makes sense in my head. Anyways, see? And then I convert it, and then it's all one color, and the overlay changes all of the different tones to fit the, the flats underneath it. I don't even know if that made sense. But I do the same thing with the, the lighting. And, uh, 
yeah. I have to say, I really, really like how this turned out. It came out pretty good. Oh, and now this is the background. I felt like, I don't know, I usually don't do backgrounds or anything in my speed drawing, so I wanted to do something a little different. And the, the background I kept really rough. I didn't add any details or anything like that. It's almost kind of like a childish drawing, and I felt like it fit the whole theme of Rel Rel and she's playful, and hey, you know what? It's Christmas. Smile. Be happy. You know what I mean? So, yeah. It's all basically just a bunch of scribbles, except for the clouds. I actually took some time to draw those in. That and the TARDIS. The other thing I really like is if you look in the corner in the top right, I love how the you know the colors and everything came together. It's I don't know. This one came out really good. And I know this the TARDIS doesn't look exactly like the TARDIS is supposed to, but it's just supposed to be a simple background object and I didn't want it to compete with Rel Rel in the front holding the present, so I kept it really simple. And uh yeah, that's pretty much it. Thanks for watching. I hope you enjoyed that. And you'll notice in the background uh, that texture I used is actually that background behind the unwakened sheep. That's a background that Jen did. And the video that's showing up there is Jen's speed drawing. So she does a lot of cute things. And uh, it'd be pretty cool to check out and like, follow, subscribe. And uh, yeah, she'd really appreciate it. So thanks again. I will be back next week with some more artwork. I'm not sure when I'm going to post, but yeah, hope everyone has a wonderful holiday. And uh, yeah, you rock. Thanks. Bye.